Hello everyone, this is Mandeep from Truby Cars. In this video, we're gonna talk about how to stay centered in your lane. We helped uh, many students in the past and uh, we can help you as well. So just make sure um, if you're new to our channel, you subscribe to our channel because we are uploading new videos every day. So how do you stay centered um, in your lane? It's very simple concept. Uh, you stare where you look. Okay, so if you want to stay centered in your lane, you need to look far ahead in the center of your lane. So for example, let's say um, you're driving around a curve, right? So we take this as an example. So you're driving around a curve and if you want to stay in the center of your lane, you need to look far ahead in the center of your lane. So you should be looking in the center of your lane over here. Now let's say um you know um if you start looking at the parked car here now there is a parked car if you start looking at the parked car here you will notice your car will start to drift into the oncoming lane okay because again you have to remember you stare where you look so always always remember that you stare where you look now if you're um you know um looking at the right side maybe you're like looking at this uh, you know let's say maybe the bicycle lane for too long your car will actually start to drift towards the right okay so if you want to stay in the center of your lane you need to focus far ahead in the center of your lane so that is a very basic uh, principle okay and the most important there are a few other things you need to uh, take care of and we will actually talk about that as well. So uh, let's say, you know, we are still going around this curve, right? So now we have this uh, parked vehicle here. Uh, definitely you wanna, you know, uh, ground view the parked vehicle, um, you know, for kids, pedestrians, right? So you should be uh, looking for pedestrians here, um, right? So there could be a pedestrian uh, in front of the vehicle. So we suggest you look, um, uh, you know, under the vehicle uh, for feet, um, but, you do, but you don't want to look there for too long because if you're just looking here that's when you know the car will start to drift towards the parked car all right so um straightforward and i'm sure you guys got it right so um let's uh let's see if we have another example um you know okay so this is good example here um so in this one now the road is curving to the left hand side so if you want to stay in the center of your lane where would you look so put that in the comments, right? So um, I will give you the answer here as well, but put that in the comment and see if you got it right or wrong. So you wanna look far ahead, about uh, 12 seconds, okay? 12 seconds far ahead in the center of your lane. That will help you stay centered in your lane. Okay, uh, so here we have another example. Um, so here's another thing uh, you need to uh, be uh, mindful of. Um, and that's your, uh, you know, following distance. So just make sure you're not tailgating other drivers because um, if you're tailgating other drivers, if you're driving, tailgating means you're driving too close to the car in front of you. So if you're doing that, your vision is actually blocked, okay? Your vision is very limited. So same thing uh, when you're driving behind a large vehicle like a bus or, you know, a semi-truck, uh, you wanna leave uh, more space, okay? So the minimum space you need is, um, you know, uh, about, uh, three seconds uh, you know if you're um, in a city if you're driving on a highway you know at a higher speed uh, you need uh, more uh, more space so um, let's uh, let's see so one of the you know common mistake that we noticed um, especially with the new drivers so uh, when they are behind the wheel they will actually they're too focused on the car in front of them all right so if you're too focused on the car in front of you what's gonna happen now you're too focused on this car here Right, so uh, you're too focused on this car. If this car starts to drift, you will start to drift with the car as well because you were not focusing in the center of your lane. You were actually focusing um, on the car in front of you. So you can see how the car is actually drifting to the right hand side, right? So how he is now uh, driving close to the white line here. So that's why we want you to actually stay um, in the center, we want you to focus in the center of your lane. So this way you can stay um, in the center of your lane. 
so we want you to focus actually you know uh, far ahead far ahead in the center of your lane over here so this way you will stay in the center of your lane all right everyone so here we have another example um you know highway ramp uh, common mistake that we see uh, students are uh, doing when they're on um you know uh, when they're on a uh, highway ramp um they already start checking on this side here they are focusing too much on um you know um on this side here and uh, they then their car will actually start to drift into the left side uh sometimes uh, they are focusing too much um you know on the um, car in front of them because uh, next time when you go on um, you know highway ramp here um, notice how the car in front of you is driving uh, most of the time like i would say you know 90% they are over here okay so they are driving like this they are driving on the white line now if you are just focusing on the car um, you know in front of you and they are not in the center of their lane you won't be in the center either right uh, because you were actually focusing on that car you were not focusing where you should be focusing so we want you to focus in the middle of your lane here um you know middle of um, of your lane so that will help you stay centered um in your lane